हेलो गाइस होप यू आर गुड वेलकम टू अनदर इंटरेस्टिंग वीडियो ऑन आवर बी चैनल इन दिस टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट स्टैटिस्टिक्स कलेक्टर वी आर गोइंग टू ब्रिंग इन द न्यू सीरीज ऑन स्टैटिस्टिक्स एंड वी आर गोइंग टू कवर ऑल दीज एंटिटीज विच आर मेजर इन द स्टैटिस्टिक्स वी विल अंडरस्टैंड देयर प्रॉपर्टीज वी विल अंडरस्टैंड देयर यूजर्स एंड वी विल स्टार्ट मॉडलिंग बाय यूजिंग देम सो स्टे ट्यून विद अस फॉर द इंटरेस्टिंग वीडियोज वी ब्रिंग इन for training and simulation modeling so if the screen which you are able to look in this is the model okay and this is the graphs which we have created by using statistics collector so by the end of this module or by the end of this video you will be able to create such a beautiful graphs by using statistics collector and that is what we are going to learn in the today's video so let us begin without wasting much of our time so if you could look at in the tab here on the left side in the toolbox we are having this almost four of our statistic collectors which we have already created so we have part a availability we have part b availability and we have part service and processor 2 the rest of the statistics collector you will understand in the next video in our series of statistics of statistic collectors so let us open this part a availability statistics collector and check in what are it so if you open the statistic collector properties you will be able to see we have events here we have columns here we have row options here we have triggers labels and in the general we are having all of these properties in here so when we go in the events back when we click on the plus sign you are able to see listen to object here and you are able to see lot many different properties listen to object by requirements create a timer event and so on so in this three graphs we are going to learn using listen to object so when we click on the listen to object type comparison so as i mentioned earlier if you could look at this is my part b buffer and c you could see the current capacity is 10 hence my system is stopped at 800 itself that's why i have kept it 60 40 but still it is not greatly optimized because my pallet get filled and this pallet has no space so it is ultimately blocking the system so this is the reason why i need to work on because uh this the reason i have kept this as 60 to 40 but i just wanted to show what was the reason i made this 60 to 40 and uh, as rightly mentioned in the next video we will be understanding about part type comparison we have made you could look at part type 1 is in the top the chart and the part type 2 is in the bottom chart in the same chart you are able to understand that rather than in this chart if you could look at i need to switch this between this part a and part b but here you could clearly understand where was the additional part created and when was the part not created so this is a great stuff of the graphs been created in the statistics collector so let us meet in another interesting video understanding part service dash processor 2 so this is that statistics collector we have created for this part type comparison so let us meet in another interesting video if you haven't liked our video please do like share and subscribe to our youtube channel do purchase of subscription which is available on beaverchannel.com for lot of exciting stuffs so let us meet in another interesting video understanding statistics collector in order to get access to this training module you need to come to beaverchannel.com and in beaverchannel.com in the simulation tab we are going to have in the subscription plans for this premium training classes you need to purchase the subscription for your requirement you can purchase it for a month you can purchase it for 3 months you can purchase it for a year here are the benefits which you will be getting by purchasing this subscription so go ahead and purchase a subscription once you have purchased the subscription you will get access to this training module and other all premium training content modules once you have subscribed to the model you will get the access to the training class page and once you get the access to the training class you will be able to get access to the training modules you will be get access to featured program you will be getting access to uh, the assessments 3ds model downloads and lot many more 
So do not forget to purchase our subscription at our simulation tab in beourchannel.com. We are eagerly waiting for you to join us on a journey of education and learning simulation. So stay tuned with us.